Hello everybody, welcome back to Mother 3 Blind. Let me explain something right off the bat here. So, I haven't uploaded in a while. I haven't uploaded Mother 3 in a while specifically because I have been so sick for the last week. And you can probably still hear it in my voice. I'm still a little sick, but the point is, I'm not so congested that I can't talk. I've gone through five toilet paper rolls in the last three days because I've had to blow my nose so much. Uh... Last night, I got one hour of sleep because I can't sleep because I, I suffocate and I wake up in a cold sweat. And that's why I haven't been able to record Mother, because I can't speak. However, right now, it has calmed down, so I'm going to try to get something recorded, I guess. And the thing is, it was also, there was a time Friday, Friday morning, or early, early morning, where I wasn't congested at all. And I was like, you know what, I'm going to take this opportunity to record Mother 3. So I, I got everything set up and I looked to my side and was like, oh, I have some laundry. I might as well get that going while I'm recording so it's done when I finish. So I take the laundry basket, go outside, close the door, realize I don't have my key. It's 3 in the morning. So there's not really anyone with a master key to the dorm rooms at 3 in the morning. I had to wait 5 hours until 8 a.m., to get back into my room. And at that point, I had class after that, and after that, I had to leave for home. So I had no chance to record that entire day when I was not congested. And then the next day, boom, congested. So here we are. Let's record something. This is a frog. He's going to record our gosh dang progress. Oh, okay. Let's get started. Sorry if that was a bit long. Let's start chapter three of Mother 3. Finally. It's been a while. Oh, okay, so we're just starting out with, uh... I'm assuming this is like a Porky machine or something. Like, the, the pig mask machine. I've been saying Porky from the last game. It's weird. Uh, the enemies of this game are like pigs, you know, pork. And wasn't the enemy of the last game... Porky? I honestly do not remember, dude. Oh, it's a monkey. Is it the- it's the bubble monkey. Oh, okay. And he has a girlfriend. Well, that was mean. Chapter 3, The Suspicious Peddler. Okay, this is weird. And the music, too. Is, a uh, very different tone from the rest of the game. We're also in a desert. Wait, that's that guy. All right, monkey, listen up. If you don't do your job, then this girly monkey is as good as dead. Wow, dude. Do what you're supposed to and you'll get to have a nice, happy reunion later. Understand? Both you and the girly monkey could wind up dead if you're not careful. Good lord, dude. Mean. Mean. Well, how do you like it? That lovely thing around your neck is no ordinary collar. It's so advanced that even if you ran to the ends of the desert, punishing you would still be a snap. Wow. Come to think of it, monkey, you don't have a name, do you? You're going to need one from here on out. I hope you can come up with something cute, new Oh, okay. I'll just speak my monkey language, and I'm sure he'll understand what my name is. A monkey who will endure anything for his girlfriend. Don't care. Salsa! Okay, I can dig that. His name is Salsa. All right, stupid monkey, salsa. I'll say this only once, so listen close. If you want to enjoy your little journey with me, just remember these two things. You and I are buddies. Don't you dare try to run away from me. Always behave and act nice and friendly. Got that? Uh, he's probably going to shock me if I say no, so let's not. <laughs> Good boy. The second thing to remember is never disobey my commands. If I say dance, you dance. If I say laugh, you laugh. It's that simple. Got it? I guess I do. Do what I say and we'll both get through this without any hard feelings. Oh? Oh, and his name's Facade. Interesting. No, what's that defiant look in your eyes? Dance! So I'm assuming... Oh, I guess left. It's <laughs> like such a silly monkey dance that just watching it is embarrassing. Try a different dance. It's like to the right? Okay. Good boy. Laugh. 
down. Backflip. Okay, so I need to remember these. Good boy, good job. No doubt everyone will behave. We're a performance... Believe we're a performance doing that. I get it. So he's... It's his name's Facade because he's tricking everyone into believing they're a duo or something. Gotcha. Also, my voice is just progressively getting worse as this recording is going on already. This is so bad. Like, I'm still very congested right now. But it's not as bad as it's ever been. I can breathe right now, which is the only way I can talk at all. Man, I, I might only be able to get one recording done. This is ridiculous. Oh no, he's crying. Hey, you stupid monkey. You only get to cry when I tell you to. No crying on your own. It's punishment time. Dude. Mean. I hate him already. I mean, you're supposed to, I suppose. There's a white round building west of here. We're going there. Okay, so we're going west. Never eat sour watermelon. Okay, it's to the left. That wasn't nice. You wound up being taken. So what's this water? Oh! Okay. Aw, oh, nice frog. Okay. So we'll save then. Why not? So... We have Salsa and Facade. Okay. Death Desert. That's an interesting name. Alright, well, let's get moving. We could still run with Facade and the monkey and everything. Okay. Okay, I'm assuming these are enemies. Is this a back attack? No. Dung Beetle. We are weak. Hold on, I probably should have checked my stats. Uh, monkey tricks. Oh, we can do all of these? What do these do? Counter an enemy with its own attack. Perform various tricks to stop an enemy somewhat. Apologize to an enemy to make it stop in its tracks. Perform various dance for dances for different results. Okay. Oh. Oh, jeez. Oh, lord. Okay. <laughs> okay. That wasn't a lot of experience. Hold on, let's check everything. So we are level one, so we will level up pretty quick. Okay, and we don't really have anything else. Nothing in our inventory? Well, inventory? No. Okay, noted. What's this? Wait, what? Oh, I'm assuming it, it heals me. Okay. So this would be a good spot to... Oh, what? Want some dung. Don't have any dung to roll, so I'm not a true dung beetle. So sad. If you ever happen to come across some dung, please bring it to me. I'll always be here, so bring me some... Okay, interesting. Bring him some poop. I'm gonna explore around here. And there's the, uh, the White House. Let's go ahead and get some more experience. Why not? So, let's try attacking. Nope. Facade's so strong compared to us. He's got to be like a boss later on or something. I don't know. Oh. Okay. Well, I think we know what to do with that. Yo, we found some dung. Yeah, I did. You're giving it to me for free? Oh, thank you, thank you, thank you. Yeah, let's roll. Let's roll to end this desert. Yeah. Okay. Oh, that gives us experience. Aw. And that's how we leveled up. Of course. Well, now we're like twice as strong now. Well, no, because we'd start with some stats. Okay, so we need to figure out a way to... Oh, new enemy. Let's fight it. Okay, so what do we have? Sand Lizard. This is different music. Oh, whoops. Kill him, please. Oh, that's scary. Boy, I got this sa this song on lockdown. You doubted me. You doubted me. And he's dead. So they're not killing me in one hit, I notice. Whoa, 10 experience is a lot. Thanks. Okay, so I should aim for those, and the dung beetles are really, like, they don't matter. I could probably just fight them and cut their fights out. A running bomb? Okay. Um, I guess I'll go ahead and heal back up, because why not? So can we give this guy more dung? Oh, what? It smells kind of dung-like. Was that in there last time? 
Can we give him more dung? Oh, nope, I guess we just give him one. So I guess I could just fight those dung beetles for the heck of it, but these... These salamanders give so much more experience. So why not do that? Let's try some things. Let's dance. We lured him into dancing, so he's just... He's just... Okay, so we distract while facade attacks is more how this is gonna go. But I do still want to get some experience for what I'm assuming is gonna have a boss at the end of this. You know what? I'll just go ahead and take you out. Get a back sprite. Oh wow, and you can actually see its face when you sneak up from behind. That's funny. Just knock him out. Finish him up. And there's some more dung. What happens if we actually check the dung? Can we do anything? Nope. It doesn't have any information on it at all. So useless, I guess, kind of. We still want to get over to that left. Luxury banana. Oh. Okay, so he, he takes it. He's literally he's just going to eat it. Okay. Can I... It's just the peels there. Oh, you can slip over it. Okay, well that sucks. Um, let's get out of here then. That was useless. Ho! Oh, new enemy. Asara Sara Sahara. So it's like symbols, I guess? Here, let's dance again. That lowered its defense by zero. Eleven damage. Okay. Let's try make laugh. They did a backflip. No one was amused. Well dang, that sucks. And he's take it out in two hits. Not a problem. And that gives us even more experience. Now we're already level four. Jeez, I like this way of leveling up. Ancient banana. Hold up. And he's not taking that away from us. Cause an enemy to slip and fall inflicting damage. Oh, interesting. So it's like a rotten banana. Basic. Ooh, you moving fast. Salamander doesn't do nearly as much damage. Oh, no. Hope the dude uses a, a fight. So, or a, a bomb. Okay. I was hoping this would affect both of them. But we're about to take a lot of damage. Come on, just kill him. Just kill him. I want, I want the, the experience, dude. Stop attacking! Okay, he's out. Can't, let's try to do something to this guy. Dude, dance with me. Oh, we turned him around. Okay. Dude, really? You lame -o. Uh, monkey mimic. Oh, okay. So we have to do it when they're attacked. It's like counter from Pokemon. Okay. Oh, okay. That was actually damage. Boy, stop that. That ought to level us up. Because that's going to be... It's going to be 25 experience. No, nothing. Okay. Bug spray. What does that do? Fast acting pesticide damages insect... Oh, interesting. I believe there were some items like that in Earthbound that only affected certain kinds of enemies. I'm just really looking for a presence here. I know I'm, I got to go upwards. Also, apparently we have to avoid some, like, whirl sand whirlpools. Or something of the like. Oop, okay, we're back over here. I forgot enemies respawn. Uh, let's get through here. Okay. Wait, this is the way we want to go, right? Ho! Oh, fro- Okay. What's up? Frogs in, in a desert? It's actually not as crazy as my- Frogs in my desert? Species frogs- Sand frogs. Okay. Interesting. I doubt that actually exists. So dizzy! Help me! What, 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 what? Oh! Well, I guess we have to earn this one. Uh, I don't want to die in one hit. And it even has boss music. Uh, beef jerky, I guess. I don't want to die. Dragged salsa over. Okay, so I dodged. That's good. Stop it. Dang it. 
Oh, he's already dead. Okay. Well, never mind. That's a waste of a beef jerky. Hey, level up. Sweet. My HP goes up by a lot every level up. Flea charm? Boy, I can equip that. Spinning in dizziness actually started to make me feel kind of nice after a while. It's gonna say, make me feel sick. Thanks for saving me when I needed help. Anyways, while we're at it, save my game. Why the heck not? And you know what? I know this is kind of a shorter one, but I, can, <laughs> I can't record anymore. Since we just saved, now's as good a time as ever. In the next episode, join us when we explore more of the desert in Chapter 3. See you all then, and goodbye.